Hey, this is Josh at CD Monastery, and I wanted to show how to use CDM tools from SourceTree or another Git repository, whichever one you want to use. So I'm going to go to our GitHub, and I'm going to be on the branch I want. I'm going to say I want to clone or download this. I'm going to grab the path. I'm going to say I want to clone it. I'm going to put it here. Destination path I'm going to set to where I have. Uh, sure, folder, whatever. I'm going to clone it. Okay, so it's been cloned. Now you see we have our local master branch. I wanted to grab a remote branch. You see there's a bunch of other ones here. I'm going to grab misdev. I'm going to double click that. And uh, double click it. There we go. And say OK. I'm going to grab that one. And then I can switch between these two branches locally, which is handy dandy. Um, but how do I get this into Maya? That is a question you might have, and let's answer that question. So you'll see we have our local data here. Our sets of Maya tools, that's our actual code is that we want. So we're going to go to our Maya environmental variable, or environmental file. I'm going to then make sure that my pathing matches to here. So I've got my repo path to my repo demo, my script path to Maya tools. Maya tools, sounds good. Everything's good. I'm going to now open my 2019, which will take a second. I'll do it while I'm pop. All right, we're in my 2019. I'm just going to type in the mail command line CGM tool box. You can see our menu is going to pop up at the top as it loads. There's our menu. Close this down. CGM toolbox. If I want the toolbox to open next time I open Maya, I just go to auto load and we're off to the races. Thanks. Have a good one.